We are back with chef and humanitarian Jose Andres, and uh, what are we making? Well, what we are making is... Wait, before that. What? You have Forgot an exciting something? announcement, and I want, oh, I, want yeah. to, I want everybody to hear that first. Yeah, I can talk about it? Yeah, yeah. I think I can. You are asking me, I can talk yeah. about it. Okay. I opened more than 12 years ago a restaurant that then closed. So I'm about to announce that in 2022, that restaurant, the Bazaar by Jose Andres, is reopening at the Grand LA. Yes, here. Across, across from Disney Hall. Yes, and I'm, I'm doing all the food at the Conrad Hotel too. I, I, I cannot be any happier. I'm back in LA. I love the bazaar, and I hope uh, we'll be again part of this amazing dining family of LA chefs. I'll be there all the time. I love Boom. it. I love it. All right. Let's see. What are we making now? OK, we are making tomato tartare. OK, tomato tartare. Yeah, you have tomatoes over here, mm -hmm. a tomato. And you're going to grab those tomatoes, and you're going to chop them. And you're going to ask me, but Jose, they look a little bit like beaten down. They look like they are not happy tomatoes. No, they are very happy. Why? Because I got the tomatoes, and I put them in the oven. In an oven, they are happy. A tartare is uncooked. So when, when it's in an oven, it's cooked. So how is it tartare if it's cooked? Well, because we are doing this. We get the tomatoes. You can use canned tomatoes. Well, you can use canned tomatoes because you can use canned tomatoes, obviously, on the name. You can, you can. Canned tomatoes. Oh, you can. That was a joke, guys. You were supposed I, to laugh. I got it. Oh, my God, that crowd. Oh my, you, yeah. All these years yeah. with these people? Oh, my God. OK, so <laughs> here, you see you're chopping the tomatoes. So what you have here? Yeah. It looks like beef tartare, but with tomatoes. Oh, my God, you're good, hell. Well, I don't want to hurt myself. OK, and now what do you do? You put cucumbers? Cucumbers. Over here. OK. You put onion. Uh-huh. You put, uh, what is this, uh, chives. You can put some olive oil. You put some salt. Basically everything that's there. Uh, everything. And then what I have here, the magic sauce. Uh -huh. What the magic sauce is? What is it? Okay. So they have ketchup, uh -huh. a little bit mustard. Uh -huh. You can put horseradish. Uh -huh. You can put parents. You can put Tabasco. You can put whatever you want, people. Okay. Be free. Don't follow a recipe. Okay. And I have here the tomato tartare, but uh -huh. then we don't end over there. Okay. We do something else. What do oh, we do? We can't smoke here. <laughs> we smoke the tomatoes. Why we smoke them? Because the tomatoes told me, Jose, I would love to be a smoke for once in my life. And I'm granting, I'm granting the tomato his wish. Right. Now we have the tartar smoke. The tomatoes are happy and we can serve them in a leaf. You want to try them? How many mojitos have you had? <laughs> I had to make sure the mojito was good. So, OK, okay I'm going to open this. OK. But the fire, the fire alarm may go off. OK. You have an umbrella? <laughs> Guys, you're going to get wet. This happens sometimes. OK. OK. Great. OK. What do I do? Try. I, I taste this? Yes, we okay. need to move. OK, we're moving. Okay. Yeah, but, but uh, it is slowly, mm -hmm. but move, come on. And now I'm going to do another thing is going to change your life forever again. Wow. Okay. Wow, that's delicious. You know I love when she does this with Wow. Me. <laughs> All right. Mm. Chop me these uh, strawberries. Mm. Yeah, here yeah. a napkin. Yep, mm -hmm. yep, yep. Chop me some of the strawberries. You put the strawberries here. Look at, look at you. I you don't, I you don't. look like D'Artagnan. I mean, you are amazing with a, I don't know with a knife. So here I have some gelatin that comes from the ocean. It's made of seaweed, strawberries. Uh -huh. I have sugar. Uh -huh. You go, you put it here, you blend it. Uh, I don't know how this works. Yeah, bo, 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 bo. and you make a use of. You're not going to use these. Why am I chopping? Because I want to see you how you chop. You did such a good job okay. on the other okay. side. Okay. 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 And then yeah. here we have all the strawberries blended. Yeah. With the gelatin. Yeah. And we put them in here. Yeah. I'm making a mousse, but mousse usually has whipped cream. Yeah. This one has no whipped cream. No. Why? Because I know you don't like whipped cream. I do. <laughs> now you tell me. Yes. I've been working all my life. Uh, oh my God. Okay. So you like whipped cream, but I made one without whipped cream. So I, I race to the challenge. Okay. First time ever that you can make a mousse without heavy cream. Huh. Why this is amazing? Because the strawberries were tired, tired of being mixed with other ingredients. The strawberries told me, Jose, I want to be me. I don't want to be mixed with anything else. I granted their wish to the strawberries because every strawberry should have their wish. And then, my friends, <laughs> we made a dreamless mousse of a strawberry. <laughs> and to finish, yeah. we do something amazing. I love this, if I know how to open them. 
pop rocks. You put them right there, and everything is going to start popping in your mouth. Go in, go in, go in. No, no, if I'm it's like, things popping no, in my it's mouth. It's not dangerous. I am an immigrant, but I'm a good guy. <laughs> All immigrants are good people. Wow. Wow. <laughs> things are popping in my mouth. Yeah, yeah. No, but you need to listen to yourself. I hear myself. No, but listen. In the moment you are listening to yourself, your mm. tongue is talking to you, the mm. strawberry is happy, celebrating. This is the good moment that things happen in life. <laughs> this is a good thing that things happen in life. I love you so much. We'll be back. <laughs>